Hello, I'm Cameron Best. It's AFL Grand Final Week and the news from Geelong is of course all about the Cats. But before we look at our extensive footy coverage, in other news, in Tuesday's Geelong Advertiser, an emergency physician at Geelong Hospital talks of his concerns about the number of young people coming to hospital affected by alcohol. Youths needing their stomachs pumped and with other alcohol-related problems are too common a sight in the emergency department. A 21-year-old man was killed in a car accident at Moolap. The car split after it, was, after it careered into a power pole shortly before 8am. And some exciting news coming out of Telstra this week with 4G mobile coverage expected. We analyse what that means for you when the new network kicks off. To the Cats now and we look at Collingwood's plan to lessen the impact of the Cats gun fullback Matthew Scarlett. James Podziadley also has his say on the big game. He says the Cats' softer entry into the grand final does not give them an advantage over the Pies. Podsy also talks about his relief after being cleared for the big one by the match review panel. And in good news for Cats fans, j -Pod is tipping injured Cats. Stevie Johnson will play on Saturday. In other footy-related coverage, we have expert commentaries from former coach Rodney Eid and regular Addy commentator Andrew Buse, who have a detailed look at the grand final. Of course, there'll be coverage of all the glamour of Brownlow night as well. And there's still time for you to win tickets to this week's grand final, and we also have a couple of 3D TVs up for grabs. Remember, there are special grand final editions of the Geelong Advertiser every day this week.